All right, guys, since I always like being fair and don't mind speaking up about something, I want to tell you the three things I don't like about the Jeep Gladiator. It would also apply to the Jeep JL. Could just be me picking, being old-fashioned. None of these would cause me not to buy a Jeep, obviously. And in fairness, Jeep Wranglers are probably the last to have it the old way because all manufacturers pretty much have went to doing this. It's just things I don't like. And I noticed because I come from the JK. Number one, the alternator's on backwards. I'm used to the alternator being turned over here with the serpentine belt across here, easy to get into. Now it's backwards. And that serpentine belt's got to be a monster to get to. I haven't checked into it or anything, but I don't even think I want to. But on the JK, as you may know, it's turned around what I would call forward with the belt right up here. Number two, I'm not going to take the lid off, but it's got what they call lifetime transmission fluid or a sealed unit. Now I know there's got to be a way to get into it. I just haven't looked into that because, you know, it ha there's got to be a way to change it and I'm sure there is, but you know, I like to be able to just to physically check with a tube and a dipstick up here like the uh, JK's was back up here under the cowling, which was a different one. You know, what happens? You know, lifetime is what? To me, lifetime is 60,001 miles or five years in one day. When the warranty's over, it's on you, on any vehicle. Um, I don't like that you can't physically check that. And my third beef, and again, none of this, this is me just picking, none of this would make a difference. It's just, I always tell you the good, so I like to tell you the only three things I don't like. Where's the radiator cap? You know the JKs have a radiator cap here. I like having a radiator cap. Look right in. Now it's what we would call, or on the old JK, it's what you'd call in the overflow bottle. Even though that's actually a pressurized system. And that cap is pressurized. There's the only cap in way over there. Unless I've completely missed something, the radiator here is semi-sealed. And I miss having the cap right here. But, you know, those are just me picking. Shouldn't have to worry about any of that stuff for ages. But it's just three things that I don't really care for. And my, my son's Chevy. And, um, what is it, a Ford? I don't remember what it is. A friend of mine's, they're that way. They've been that way for a long time, you know. But them are just three things that I kind of wish was the other way, like in the JK. Other than that, everything's great. And like I said, I'm just picking. I know most manufacturers are doing that. By the way, if you wonder what happened to the other one of these, there's two of these here. Why it's sitting down here. Check out my video on uh, auto start stop hacks. That disables it. Takes about a minute to do and a minute to put back. All right. Um, I believe that's all I got for you today, guys and gals. Share and subscribe. As always, thank you for your time. Vegas Dave, peace and out.